that's going to be the biggest thing here. Because Mega Man can use one of his three lemons to stave off a boomerang or an arrow or anything, really. What's up with forward smash? Very nice. So right from the offset, uh, something that I recently found out is Mega Man's uh, lemons are frame 7, which is really slow. But still, for the range you get out of it and the interruptions, definitely worth it. Okay, let's see how it goes. Frencher is definitely trying to close the distance really quickly. He doesn't want to see uh, King Arc getting his pe pending uh, lemon pressure out, pellet pressure out. Oh, and here comes the first uh, bomb. Nice, get the forward smash, uncharged. You have to watch out for, uh, you also have to watch out for uh, Crash Bomber. That thing can, I'm sure everyone knows this already, it can attach to our opponents just coming off the respawn platform. So don't let him get you. And French Tutor in dire straits here, he's dead. French Tutor, no. So something that's really important to know, I'm unsure if French Tutor knows this, if Mega Man sticks a Crash Bomber to the side of a stage, like if it's attached to a wall, it will blow up immediately when someone touches it. It won't wait for the timer to run out. So it is a really effective tool at disrupting recoveries and stuff like that. Because it's like, oh man, they're going to come back, but they have to get through uh, Crash Bomber first. Yeah, let's see what we got. King Arc is making short work right here. Down air, gets the spike, and that's it. A one, one and a half minute match, Jesus. French Tour is going to have to step up his game if he wants to keep up here. All right, the bands come out. They are Battlefield and Lilac. That in mind, French Tutor may pick uh, Yoshi's story. I fought him a couple of times. He is happy to uh, counterpick that stage against me. So he might do it against King Arc. No, he's choosing Town and City. All right, then. Let's see how that goes. I'm unsure on the rationale here, but I trust King Arc's judgment. I in French Tutor's judgment. All right. Let's get it started. Game two. Just as quickly as the last game ended, this game has started. Wow, ledge attack. Knowing that Mega Man can't shield with Leaf Shield up, and that uh, ledge attacks beat everything. <laughs> nice. Wow! Arrow into. Oh my gosh, I can't even like explain that, but. Fred Shooter, you're a genius! Oh. Oh. Alright, Fred Shooter's doing a good job here. Mega uppers the bomb. Oh my god. He was hoping that the active frames would be enough to just give Link the sweet spot. But no such luck yet. Ooh, up air. Very good tool for landing on shields. And French Tutor not falling for a ledge trump from Mega Man. King Arc, one of the players that I actively see use uh, ledge trumping for sure. Instead of going for the uh, ledge traps, he will be happy to try it. <laughs> Another Mega Upper. Here we go, French Tour's got the lead. Let's see, what if he, let's see how long I can keep it going. Oh. Nice, up smash, scoops, and doesn't kill Link. Very, my man is heavy, and there he goes. <laughs> Flying off at two miles an hour. Got launched like it was Smash 4. It's stuck with the Crash Bomber. Can't seem to avoid it. Here we go. Oh, that's an SD. Dinger tried to stave off the pressure using a leaf shield, but unfortunately got knocked off the stage. I have to wonder if that was hold buffered or if he just accidentally pushed it, not knowing the situation. Regardless, good play from French Tutor. Let's see if he can keep the pace up. Yo, did 
Yo, he did double Z drop in there. I like that. He wants to get a... Oh, that's a down air. French sure bet a lot on that. I respect what he did, but it did not work out for him, unfortunately. There we go, King Arcs. King Arcs making pace back to making... It Blah. Making pace back to being even. Nice. <laughs> wow, look at this man. Throwing his projectiles at him. Boomerang's coming back and interrupts. Up smash. Super strong in this game. They've just been making Link stronger and stronger in, in Smash. And it's come to a fever pitch in this game for sure. My dude! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, triples the bomb, nares it all the way up to King Arc. Let's see that again. This absolute maniac. This absolute unit. Oh my god, look at this, look at this. He's just like, throw the boomerang, bait him up to jump. Oh my god, look at this. Baits him to jump too, that's the best part about this. Sends it perfectly, it's just like, no. Beautiful. Absolutely magnificent. French tutor. King Arc. Who will emerge victorious? Mega Man! Blink! Three. Okay, good. I can go to Alpha 3. Nice. Go. But now we're talking about Xeno. 165 winner's quarters pools. We go. This is King Arc's counter pick. I'm a little surprised. He did such a good job on Final Destination with no platforms, and he's opting to pick a stage that's a little more densely platformed. Even after he uh, banned off Lilat and Battlefield. We'll see how this plays out. Oh, nice. Jumps away with Leaf Shield, then just jumps away, then just comes right back with Leaf Shield. Uh, Milo Tick coming into the spectator seats in the background. Very nice, very nice. Everyone say hi to Milo Tick. Look at this. These guys are. These guys are fighting it out with our heart and soul. I love it. Oh. Pulls the bomb room. Knows that uh, King Arc isn't going to challenge him down low. So he's just like, I'm going to pull the bomb out. Why not? Get it for later. Ledge jump item toss is pretty good. If you have an item, ledge jump item toss is a very strong technique. Throws it. Ooh. Saves him from the Mega Buster. And. Yeah. King Arc not wasting the opportunity, just runs up, mega uppers them. Marvel 2 style. No good. And King Arc did run away to ensure he wouldn't get tagged by ledge attack. I like it. It's gonna be tough. He needs to be careful about uh King Arc just throwing out a forward smash. Avoid it. Mm, French tutor bomber covers the wrong way. Very unfortunate. Digging it. You should be careful about doing that, though. As all those air dodges do add to your uh, dodge staleness queue. And I know it doesn't come to play very often, but, you know, if you're spamming 50 dodges into Rush Coil like that, you should be a little careful. Anyway, French Tour is finally on the board, at least. And that goes in a tech situation. Whimsicott's here. King Arc throws him off the stage. All right, this is a Gimp situation. He's not even going to try. And, oh, French Tutor unfortunately dies from a second uh, failed bomb recovery. Still, though, good show from both players. Very good set. What do you think, Empty Chair? At a loss for words, as always.